Once again, we're back here in the back of the Crystal Park Casino, One Love in Compton, in collaboration with the city of Compton. And we're doing a car show, you know, and uh, we just want to let everyone know this is the second annual car show we're giving. We have one in December. We have another one coming up in December. You know, we appreciate everybody that came out today and anticipated. And, you know, we had a wonderful time and we're going to do this many more times. I'm Council Member Jonathan Bowers, City of Compton, District 3. I'm at the Crystal, uh, Crystal Casino for the One Love in Compton car show here at the rear of the, uh, the hotel. Uh, it's a great day. It's a great community event. Uh, just encouraging everybody to come on out and participate and uh, just, just enjoy all the, uh, the, the, the um, vendors here, the music. And it's just a great day for everybody to come out and just, you know, uh, unite in our community. I'm Chris. I'm here at the One Love and Compton Car Show. I'm here with my 66 Chevy Ragtop Impala. I've had it probably about 15 years. I chromed the inside and customized the inside, chromed underneath my hood. Uh, put a fifth wheel back on the back of it, which you don't see too much on a 66. Uh, put airbags on it, which is remote control, uh, cordless. And just been working on it for about, and still working on it, because you never finish working on your car. So it's a um, work in progress. My name is Johnny Nettles. I'm here at the One Love and Compton Car Show. This is my 1938 Buick Roadmaster Limo. I've been had for about six or seven years, and I did almost everything to it except for the paint job. I put the new interiors in it, uh, upholstery, and had everything chromed out on it. It runs well, and I'm just glad to be here today. All right, uh, my name is Ron. Most people call me Slim, and uh, this is my car, 1941 Plymouth. Uh, it has right-hand drive, steering column. It has airbags, front and back. It has uh, suicide doors. Front and back. And uh, I've had the car for 38 years. This car has been two different colors. This is the final project, and uh, I enjoy it. I want to say thank you to One Love and Compton. I had a guy to convert it from left-hand drive to right-hand drive. And uh, it took a while. The whole project for this car took me three years of uh, restoration. It, uh, it had to go through quite a bit, uh, a little body work. I made this paint, the paint I mixed this white myself. This blue came off of a uh, Honda. Uh, I've done a few things to it. Uh, it has uh, up-to-date headlights. Uh, they're running those now, so I thought I'd do that. Also, uh, if you notice, there's no lines in my body. I took all the lines out the car. Even the running boards are molded in. There's no lines in it at all. And, uh, yeah, so... I mean, I've had it a long time. This car is older than one of my sons. <laughs> I've had it longer than he's been in the world. So, it's called 41 Below. That's the license plate because my 41 Below. That's why it's called that. How you doing, everybody? My name is Rick Mendoza. Here with a 54, 1954 Chevy Bel Air. We're here at the One Love Car Show in Compton, California. For my brother, for, uh, for uh, my brother here, the car show. I'm gonna give you guys a little bit of detail and intel on the car. Um, it started out as a family build, built it all with family and love. Um, pretty much, it was built for uh, the streets, but it's starting to go to the big shows and hanging there with the big boys. You know, nice little family cruiser. Um, it does, you know, have a little bit of modifications on it. We candied out the roof. Uh, has a 250 inline six S10 rear end, so it is a freeway runner. 
and uh, it also has a little bit of custom work in the door jams I'll show you here in just a minute uh, so as you see here we did a little bit of custom work in the door jams So uh, the roof was done by a, a good friend of mine named uh, George from JNR Customs. The airbrushing mural work was done by a uh, GR1 uh, airbrushing, real good friend of mine named Tony. And uh, so yeah, man, the gold leafing on the doors uh, also done by a family member of mine, by uh, Angelo Lopez from Cartudo Magazine uh, Photography. So yeah, that, that, that's a little bit about my car. And uh, hope you guys enjoy the day of the show and, and have a good time here in Compton, California. My name is Hilton Dawson. I'm from Compton, California. This is a 1966 Chevy Impala. Uh, I painted it blue because I went to Compton High and I like blue. Now, when I got this car, it didn't have anything on it. So I had to put doors, hood, I had to do all the interior. I had to uh, do the motor. And uh, I leave it stock because a lot of people want me to put airbags on it and change the rim, but I like the original look. So I left it original. And uh, I two-toned the interior because I like the white and blue, the combination where it looks to, with the white and blue. And uh, I got the original rims on there, the Raleigh Sports. I left there everything original. And uh, it's a 329 in here with a, uh, a 200R transmission. It runs pretty good. And uh, I left the original radio, uh, radio in there, but I, um, I left the original radio, as you can see, the original radio, but I upgraded and I put the, the upgrade radio in the uh, glove box. And it runs pretty good. And I like it. 1966 Chevy Impala. Thank you. So uh, I'm Jay, uh, J6 Trey. This is Patina Tina. Um, uh, she's a 63 Bel Air wagon, Chevy Bel Air wagon. Uh, I had her about two years in June. She's been cut for about uh, a month after I picked her up. So straight to one way, front and back, corner and corner. Uh, I do all my own work. We break it, we fix it, we come back outside. That's the motto. Uh, change the A-arms, uh, change the rear end. Uh, so I have a four nine inch uh, chrome rear end in there now. Um, it has eight batteries set up for 10. Uh, my Instagram is j 6 tray J-A-Y number six, T-R-A-Y. Uh, just my journey of low riding you know being outside uh so my dad had cars he had cars when i was like seven or eight years old he had a six feet i was front and back uh getting picked up from that in school is like you know the best feeling ever i was a cool kid so i want to do the same thing for my three kids make memories that are priceless you know i think that's the best part of low riding how you doing uh my name is robert uh, I'm from We With It Car Club. This is my 1967 Chevy Impala. I've had the car in my possession uh, since 2016, but I just got ownership of the car in 21. Uh, it's a beautiful car, but you know, 67s are very hard to get parts for. You know, so you just can't hurry up and finish it. But you know, it's, it's worth the, uh, the wait. The car belonged to a friend of mine named Raper who passed, passed away. He was the president of the car club and uh, he chose uh, for me to have it. So uh, eventually I ended up with it even though I had the car in my possession. Uh, you know, we did some pretty nice work on the uh, interior, on the engine. You know, it's still, it's still coming together, but you know, I think I'm gonna really appreciate the car when it's done because, you know, it's a, a, a friend of mine that used to be president of the club. And, uh, 
you know, we're going to try to uh, keep it not as, as a competition, but, you know, a land play car in the low, low rider scene, and uh, we're out to have fun in the car, you know what I'm saying? I don't have a whole lot to say about the car, but I appreciate having it, and, you know, it's a gym to me. My name is uh, GT. I'm from We With It Car Club. Uh, my, this is my 73, my project. Uh, I, I'm, I'm having fun with it. It's like a 10 year project now, but it's mine. Uh, I painted it myself, so that's, I, I'm proud of that, but it's getting ready to go under the knife again because I'm getting ready to uh, chrome the underneath and repaint it, even though it's going to be the same color. And uh, yeah, man, it's just uh, it's a joy because I bought this car just to fill a void, so to speak, till I could get me a, a old Chevy, and I come to enjoy it. So here I am. How you doing? This is Martin. My Cadillac. I bought it back about six years ago. It was destroyed. Got it together. Brought it back to life. And that's my car here. I call her the Golden Girl. There's a bad story about it, but there's a good story for it. I put airbags on it. I'm not into the hydraulics too much. Interior's all original. Four door, the Brome, 94. Had quite a things done to this car. There was an old gentleman that bought it from me. I bought it from him, sorry. And he didn't want to sell it because it was his wife's car. But when he did sell it, she wanted a small car. So I got lucky on this. In 1994, I wanted a Cadillac. I couldn't pay $38,000 for no Cadillac like this. And I bought it for $4,000. Needed a little work here and there, but she's still running, she's still working. Got 150,000 miles on it, which I put the 50,000 by myself. It's got 13 inch tires. The custom paint job was done for a friend of mine. He did all the pinstriping. I got the plaques on the windows, the illusions, the front window, the back window. I'm involved with my club. I take care of my club. We're here for the clubs. No matter what the race is, no matter what us, we all follow it. No ignorance here. That's straight out what I am. I'm Martin, that's all I got to tell you. My motor's still there, it's still running, and she's gonna run for a long time. My son can't wait till I'm gone. <laughs> so that's what's going on. Thanks for all this. My name is Slim from Compton. It's a 1963 Chevy Impala with a 42 inch moon. It's basically all brand new, frame off, body off and everything. Every screw is chrome mostly. And it took me a while. The paint is 14 years old, but it looked this brand show new. Is the first annual it comes from being garage all the time. Rides nice, sound good. One and and I just tried to come out and hang with my partners my and uh, bring it out. My, my group, Jonathan that's about Bowers, it. Lily my Dunn, first one, so I think I did pretty good. So, I've had, I've owned the car for uh, cars, 17 years, vendors, and it's going but it's been beautiful. on the street the for two. It's fantastic. Give yourselves a round of applause for being out here today, y'all, yep. and supporting the CPT. Now, if y'all don't know who I am, hey, how you doing? My name is Billy Taylor, and this is a 1965 Impala Super Sport. I'm the second owner of it. It only has like 73,000 original miles on it. Bought it from a, a lady a lady from work that uh, sold it to me back in 96. And it's all original. This is original paint, which is a, it's called Evening Orchid. It's original paint that only came out in 1965. And um, everything you see, I've done to it, and I'm gonna keep it this way, stock and original. Good afternoon, Otis. My name is Starvin Marvin. This is a 1950 businessman coupe. Uh, this is the second paint job. I've had it for 30 years. I, I totally restored it. 
I, I started off with a flathead six, and then I put in a, a, a 350 motor with a 400 trance. Been totally, totally restored. Uh, believe it or not, I'm 33 years clean and sober, and me and a buddy of mine used to smoke crack in this car. So I will never get rid of this car because it's my sobriety car. Uh, ain't too much more to say. There's four owners of this car. They're all from Compton, Jerry, Lorenzo, Ronnie, and now me. And I've had it for 30 years. And I'm out here to enjoy this wonderful summer day in Compton, the city that I love. My name is Tootsie. My last name's Guerrero. Um, this is my 1964 Impala. Um, it's an OG ride. I've had it for about maybe uh, about four years. Um, but I'm going to keep it OG. I'm not really going to do much to it, but I just love to drive it and cruise in it. It's not a daily driver. It's just uh, take it out to all the car cruises, car shows. Um, during the week, I go out to a couple car shows. Um, today, we took it out to uh, Norm's. And today, we're at One Love in Compton. Um, my friend Francis and Sam brought us out here today, so um, uh, we came out to support. My family actually all OG lowriders. Um, we've always we've always had bombs and Paulas. So um, my dad my dad cruise, my uncles cruise. Um, we've been I've been a, a lowrider since I was a little girl. We've always cru cruised in our in our in our old cars. I'm the Mad Hatter out of Watts. I represent All Rags Car Club. I'm here today supporting the black man with this beautiful car show that he gives every year. I drive a 67 Impala convertible. It's, uh, I bought it like this. I'm finna have it repainted. And um, I just put music in it and try to support all the local Compton functions. And that's all I can say. <laughs> just a nice day, in, nice day in the neighborhood. Supporting Compton. Yeah, my name is Tom. Yeah, this is a uh, 48 Cadillac two-door uh, coupe seat net. And I had this about 20 years. And I spent a lot of time, money into it. And I love the car. Uh, plan to enjoy it. So it's a uh, project still in progress. And I uh, plan to enjoy it for the next 20 years at least. When I bought it, it was a kind of a basket case. You know, it was in parts, and I went to buy two or three different um, shops and soaked up a lot of money. But I uh, ended up uh, finding one guy called Mauricio. Mauricio did the bodywork, paint, and some of the other uh, improvements in the car. I think he made a nice car for me, and I would recommend him at any time. So, Mauricio, hey, he spent about maybe a uh, Good year and a half, two years, every day uh, for those that length of time, and it's where we are at this point. I had a bit to do, but I'll get there. Thank you. Hey, name Harvey Roberson from Compton, California. Uh, this is a 62 Cadillac, 62 series convertible. Um, I got it about 18 years ago, and what I did to it, I put Tires, tops, the paint was just about there. And uh, I retrofitted it with a 700R4 uh, Cadillac uh, transmission. Oh, it's a Chevy transmission, really. And um, up under the hood, I just kind of kind of ret retrofitted it with the bat wing, upgraded the alternator to 200 amp, chrome the valve covers, that right there is my um, tranny cooler. So it gets on the highway and it rolls pretty good. It's like a daily driver. Uh, it's been in a, a lot of what Justin Timberlake's video, done BB's clothes, um, Michael Kors, um, the uh, purse guy. Um, what else I do on this car? A lot of events I. I took it too, so it just about paid for itself.